In this video, I'm going to show you how to set automatic replies from a shared mailbox in Outlook. The best way to do this is to go to Outlook on the web. So you'll want to go to outlook.office365.com forward slash mail. Now, once your mailbox is loaded, you'll want to go to your icon in the top right. This will either be your initials or your profile icon. Once you click on that, you'll want to go to open another mailbox. Here you can type the name or the email address of the shared mailbox that you want to access and then just click open. This will then open your shared mailbox on a separate tab. Once that has loaded, you'll want to go up to your top right again and you'll want to go on the settings cog icon. At the very bottom of this pop-up menu, you'll see view all Outlook settings. So we'll just click on that. Now you want to make sure you're in the email section of these settings and then you can go down to automatic replies. You can then turn on the automatic replies and you can choose to send during specific time periods. If you do this, you do get some extra options, including to block out the calendar, automatically decline new invitations and decline any existing meetings. You then have the option to write your message for replies inside your organisation, so to those contacts who work with you, your colleagues, and you have the option to send replies to people outside of your organisation, but this can be toggled on and off. You do also have the option to send replies just to contacts of that mailbox too. And once you're finished, you simply press save and your automatic replies will be activated. Now an alternative option you do also have here is the forwarding. So if we discard that, you can actually forward those emails. So if you tick on here, you can forward all the emails to that shared mailbox to another email address. And you can also keep a copy of any forwarded messages in the shared mailbox. But it is worth noting that there is no time frame on this. So you will have to manually come back in and disable the forwarding.